phone. So as you can see, I have a Windows 10 login screen right here um, with the uh, admin pulled up right here, which has a password on it, which um, say I don't know it right. How would I get back into my computer? Um, that is what Kali Linux is for, and I'm going to be showing you that right now. All right, everyone, so now we are on Kali Linux. Um, just some background, though. You'll have to get a live bootable USB um, of Kali Linux that you can install onto your um, onto a USB flash drive. Um, that way you can use it, and you can also access the files that we're going to access on here. Um, there's tons of videos out there how to create a live uh, USB for Kali Linux, so it's not too hard. Um, and also won't take any up, up any of your hard disk because you're going to put on a USB. So basically how you're going to take the Windows 10 password off is you're going to go here to open folder. You're going to want to get into your um, wherever your Windows uh, partition is located, which mine is right here. I'm going to go down to the Windows. Um, you're going to go down pretty far to System32, which is right here. A little bigger file so it should take a little bit longer to open up. Um, once you're in here though you're going to want to go to right click anywhere and click open terminal here. Um, then you want to change directories into the config file and then what you're going to do is you're going to do this command right here chntpw minus l and then sam all capitals. Type in your root password, which is probably just the password that you used to get onto Kali Linux, and it's going to come up with a list of all of the accounts that are on that Windows file. So here's my admin one that I just showed you. So now we're going to type in basically the same thing, except you're going to do minus u, and then put whatever the username is that you want to log back into. So mine will be admin. Um, space Sam again. Okay, so it's going to bring up this little interface. Um, so what you want to do is you want to click uh, type the one which is going to clear the user password. Okay, so I type one right here, press enter. It should come up with the same thing. That's fine. Uh, you're going to click Q to quit and then you're going to click yes so that it will actually change it so it won't have a password on it. Once you click yes, you should go back to this. Once you're done with that, you should be able to get out of your terminal and restart your computer and go back onto Windows and it should just log you in without prompting you for the password. So now we are booting back into the Windows um, into Windows 10 to see if it took off the password on the admin account. Um, it shouldn't even prompt me for it. It should just log in. Yep, there we go. We are welcomed with open arms without a password. Um, so now you should be able to go into your settings and set a new password and everything should work fine. So yeah, if this helped you guys out, please leave a like and subscribe and good luck getting back into your computers.